Welcome to the Craft Beer Review. If you like talking beer, hit subscribe and be sure to leave me a comment to let me know what you think. All right, I'm in the process of developing my own German Pilsner recipe. Uh, and part of the process is tasting a few examples. Uh, I recently had uh, Wursteiner Pilsner uh, from a uh, brewery in Wurstein, Germany. And tonight I'm gonna try an American example. This is Prima Pils, German style Pilsner from Victory Brewing Company in, out of Downingtown, Pennsylvania. All right, this is 5.3% alcohol by volume. Uh, on the label, they describe it as a crisp yet distinct Pilsner brewed with German hops that bring vivid notes of floral and spice with citrus and lemon. Uh, this is a truly brilliant, bringing nuanced complexity together with smooth, easy drinking. For malt, they list Pilsner, hops, Tetanang, Hallertau, Spalt, and Zartz. Uh, let's see, Brewmaster's approval. They've got the signatures of the Brewmasters on there. That's nice. And best by October 12th, 2021. That's a few months away, so we're good. All right. Quick look at the bottle. Doesn't seem to be anything else on the label. That pretty much sums up the information they have on their website, other than their website does note that this beer is uh, available all year round. And I'm guessing this is gonna be a clear beer. I'm not seeing, just from looking through the bottle here in the light, it looks pretty clear. So let's open it up and uh, find out. left in there all right that's in wow that's crystal clear kind of uh, yellowish color nice white head on top very clear nice carbonation grainy uh, <laughs> grainy Pilsner malt aroma with a decent amount of uh, floral aroma. I can't say that I'm getting any uh, citrus or lemon that they uh, mentioned. Nope, just kind of grainy Pilsner malt character with some floral notes. It smells good. Cheers! Hmm. That's interesting. I think I picked up a little of that uh, citrus in the flavor. Not in the aroma, but I think I got some of it in the first sip. Uh, first impression, Pilsner malt graininess. Um, I don't know what the IBUs are on this, but uh, definitely had the... Uh, German Pilsner bitterness to it. I mean, German style Pilsner is usually uh, relatively bitter compared to other Pilsners. There is a significant amount of floral hop flavor as well. I wasn't expecting that much, uh, that much floral flavor. I mean, I was expecting the bitterness, but not the, uh, not the flavor. Mm. That's pretty good. I like that. Mm. It's it's just enough floral flavor for the beer. It's not overpowering, but it's I have to say that it's, it's more than I think I've tasted in any other pilsner. Mm. I'm liking this. This is good. I would say so far after the first couple sips, 
Uh, this particular Pilsner, the Prima Pils from Victory, has uh, more hop character uh, than I was expecting. I mean, when you take into account the bitterness combined with the uh, floral flavor, it has a lot of hop character to this beer. I wasn't expecting that from a Pilsner. The more I drink it, the more I'm tasting it too. And it's, um, at first the Pilsner malt graininess was the dominant flavor, but the more I drink it, the more that floral flavor is building in my mouth. And uh, at this point, I'd say that's the dominant flavor. Mm, tastes good. I'm really liking this. I'm in New Jersey, Downingtown, PA. Isn't that far away? I might have to see if I can schedule a trip out to this brewery. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that's good. At this point, I'm. I take a sip. I'm not really. I'm barely noticing the Pilsner malt graininess. Uh, maybe that's coming through at the end a little bit, mixed with the bitterness, but um, I'd say the dominant flavor is that floral car character from the hops. Uh, it's been building in my mouth, on my palate, and um, I'm enjoying it. I like it. Um, I guess that shouldn't be surprising, considering uh, they do use four different hops in this beer, so... Uh, I guess it shouldn't be surprising that it has a uh, decent amount of hop character. Let's see, I guess to rate this beer out of five stars, I would give it a solid four. It's good. I would buy this again. Uh, I really would buy this again. I'm enjoying this a lot. Cheers.